Namaste. This is introducing a new series on the book Kaivalya Navanitam and uh, also to introduce my friend Sri G. D. Swami. And I met him on the Parikram path around the sacred hill Arunachala. And he's graciously consented to meet with us and speak on this wonderful book, Kaivalya Navanitam. Now, this book was very much praised and highly regarded by Ramana. So Ramana Maharshi uh, has said that everything is in this book. And uh, while speaking with the Swamiji about it, he said the same exact thing. Everything is in this book. You read this book, you don't need to read anything else. You first find out that man. That is the teaching in this. Yes. <laughs> okay. It is the Ramana Maharishi always quoting this book. Hmm. Yeah, always quoting some paragraphs, this type of. Well, Tamil verses. Maybe you could explain then why this is so important. Okay. Yeah, this is very important because it shows the way how to get God in words or how, how to get yourself, how to see yourself. It is always telling you must see, you must see, you must see. It is not a hearing. It is not uh, so simply meditating. You must see that thing. So what you are seeing, you are seeing yourself. Mm -hmm. You are seeing yourself. That is first stage. Then you will become the self and self is seeing everything. Inside yourself is seeing everything. That's the realization. That, uh, that is the description he is giving and finishing. It has two parts. First part is philosophy. Philosophy. What is body? What is mind? What is sakshi, witness? What is everything? The first one. The second one is <coughs> sandeham telital. Clear of doubts. Mm. Clear of doubts. What the, doubt? the second part of the book is about clearing the doubts. Yes. Second part is clearing the doubt. In between, what is happening? Guru transferred his power to Sishya. Sishya, find out what is what. So, between this, some uh, first part and second part, Guru is giving his Diksha and he saw everything, he became everything. Immediately, he saluted his Guru and asking what I, I have some doubts. That is the second part. Uh -huh. So after realizing only, the second part is coming. After realizing? Yeah, after yes. self-realization only, yes. the second part is coming. This is what we call this post-enlightenment. Yeah. There are issues. Yeah. It's not like you become enlightened and that's it. No, not like There's that. more. There is more. Mm. See, you, your self is Getting outside of your body is telling like that. Yourself easily can come out of your body. Your body can live. In that self, that self is... That self, after leaving this body, the self is experiencing something. It is experiencing, not yourself. You are experiencing only self. Self is experiencing everything. And it will come to your brain, this body brain. So we are, uh, we, you know, we cannot forget that uh, self. Like that it is. That is the teaching of Kaivalya Navanila. See one, one, one man, he is coming, he is doing, performing his house duties. Many years after he is thinking, why I am doing all these things? Cha, wife, chi, children, chi. Like that he got oh. the rug. 
Virag, that is he called back. Virag, Virag. Renunciation. Yeah, renunciation, yes, the correct word. Then he he want to get out of this all worries. <laughs> this man earthly worries. No, he is running and uh, uh, saw a guru. He saw one guru. Immediately he saluted him and asked him, How can I get out of this all troubles? Guruji told, You fool, come on, sit down. Why you are worrying? You know? Why you are worrying? You don't know. We can see the work. Why don't we start at the beginning? This is the beginning. Yeah. <laughs> Before you were, yeah, you were reciting that verse. It was very nice. Uh, you can recite, and I can give the translation. Yeah. And then uh, we can begin. Begin at the beginning. Ista Deva Namaskara Vadeva Mangalam. This is a book. First, I will tell you. This is the book of Kaivalya Navanidam. Kaivalya means mukti. You know mukti? Liberation. Yeah, liberation. Navanidam means butter. Butter. So what he is saying, I read so many Upanishads, so many Vedas, so many books. I practiced many books, many ways. And our forefathers also done many things. I take everything and put in one vessel. I Churn. boiled it. Yeah. I boiled it. Yeah. So it comes, butter comes. Yeah. That is the butter of this Kaivalya Navanidam. Mutsika butter. That is the correct word. Kaivalya Navanidam. That is Mukti. Uh, like butter I am giving you. You can eat directly. Mm. You can. You don't worry about anything. All things are in in this. Ah. That is the introduction. The book is telling anything. This first poem is Namaskar. Namaskar to whom? Don't know. Sachi only witness. So I namaskar that witness. He is not uh, saluting Brahma. He is not saluting Shiva. He is not saluting Vishnu. He is not saluting anything. He is saluting <coughs> the self within him. First, he is saluting his self. Uh, that is the word. He, this is the namaskara, solution for his self. Atma. Uh, he is describing this self, self's characters. How? Pun. Nilam Madar Asai. Pun. Nilam Madar Asai. Pun. Gold. Nilam. Sand. Madar. Ladies. The one who is lust on these things or one who is out of these things. Both have the witness inside them. So I salute that witness. That is the first, first poem. I like your description much better than this <laughs> I don't know the uh, correct words. I am telling very easily what I know. Yes, uh, tell in simple you, language. Yeah, can fun. you understand this? Oh, yes. Uh, then we will go to uh, second poem. You're, th you're through with this one? Yeah. So, second one coming. That's it? Yeah, yes. Yendru alithu alikyum saigayki yeduvai ayanai malai andra isanumai tane ananda murtiyumai nirkum poondra muttanumai inba punariya adavanai nalum thondriya vimalabada sorupathai panigindrene. So, you can explain the meaning? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He is telling Guru is coming to you. When you are ready, Guru will come to you by five ways. Five ways he will come. First, he is telling Kosaram. Kosaram means without body, or without any picture, without any photo, or without any murti, idol. 
it will show like that some bright light hmm. guru will come like a bright light that is what he called bodha swarupam vimala bodha swarupam that is extend wisdom full swarupam swarupam means image uh, mm, he will come like that whatever you are seeing that image and it is very blissful it is very light very lightful itself it is showing itself with whatever god you like you want ramana maharishi it will show like ramana maharishi if you want the shiva lord shiva it will show whatever you want it will show it say like, that means yeah. kosaram you can see it whatever god you want whatever your guru want whatever you want the first thing he will come like so that. guru will come through whatever form you yeah, want to you want if you want ramana maharishi he will come like ramana maharishi mm-hmm. somewhere from uh, that is the second indru alithu alikum seigaikku eduvai maayanai mala aandra eesanumai thane ananda murtiyumai nirkum that is <coughs> brahma who is creating vishnu who is preserving a uh, preserving you who is uh, maintaining shiva who is destroying you can see in these three forms you can see in these three forms three murti uh, three murti otherwise you can see ananda murti so many gods semi gods demi gods you can see you can see it in your dhyana meditation he will come like that that is what you know he will come like a blissful light great for great light he will come that is the second thing these are not uh, very important because this five uh, poems are simply he is telling how he is coming but i think it's important that to know that guru can come in these different forms because people have a very fixed idea of guru that guru is a man and you take one guru and you get diksha from that guru and then he is your guru for life or forever no these are all wrong things i know that's these why all wrong things <laughs> that's why it's important to i will tell you one thing yeah. <coughs> that's my own experience if i tell my experience you that's can better. easily easily understand yeah. these are the books to refer our experiences only what we are experiencing we will take the correct poem and we can correct it mm-hmm. uh, we can correct it we can uh, see this book whether it is correct what we saw is yes. correct or not so like that what happened this. to you so what, what happened no? i am an ardent uh, pious man for muruga lord muruga muruga yes my life has changed from this earthly jobs to spirituality by sri sri rahavendra swami rahavendra yeah rahavendra swami he showed my guru he showed me my guru so i be with my guru only and the first thing first temple i entered is chotranikara bhavari at ernakulam kerala hmm uh, ernakulam there is a, there is a place chotranikara it's a famous place okay. yeah and after that now rajendra swami shows me baba Sai Baba, Shirdi Sai Baba. Shirdi Sai Baba. Uh, yeah, now I am worshiping him, and according to according to the way Raghunandra Swami showed me, I am praying Baba Ji. Okay, now I will tell you. Always I am thinking of Murga, Lord Murga. Always I will say Murga, Yallarin ka part like that. I wanted to see him. My Guru Ji blessed me. He will. so himself uh with his veil you know mm-hmm. no veil spirit so i don't know i want that peacock also <laughs> <laughs> i don't want to see the veil would spear only because that's his war war like uh, yeah it, it is created by the, uh, our god of peacock Pavel. is more like home homely moon yeah. yeah and so many colors also very playful mm. So my, I told like that. My Guru Ji told, no, you will get the vision of uh, Murga with the veil, spare only, no pickup. I told. 
so many years before. So after two years, well, I, I have always a Muruga photo. I saw many Murugas uh, temples, many photos, everything. But what I saw, Muruga, she came in my meditation. How I never saw that photo. Uh -huh. You understand that? Right. I, it was a new... Yeah, vision. it is a new form. Mm -hmm. It's a new form. I was sitting like this. What wonder this is? I never saw this like a form. He's only having spear and Ashirwad. Right. So my word, my Guruji told was correct. And I was immediately phoning to my form. Guruji, Guruji, what is this? I never saw this type of... Uh, Muruga's photo anywhere. That's what you want. That's what. That is for you, not us. My understanding is, we each have a unique, uh, special relation with God. Yeah, we got our own God. Right. So nobody's God is the same as everybody. No, else. no, 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 no. See, I never know Sai Baba. Sri Sai Baba, I never know. This is a second experience I am telling you. I left my Guruji because uh, he told our contract, you are, uh, you, you are Raghavendra's uh, Sishya, you are his man. He sent me for a contract. So now the contract is over, you can go to your Raghavendra Swami, like that he said, <laughs> <laughs> because I finished all his works. Uh -huh. yeah, definitely guru and disciple in one sin should separate. Not that guru is guru forever, but for one phase, one stage. Yeah, 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 yeah. So mm. he will allow us to go room free and come back, like that only. If we got any doubt, he will clear it. We will be with him, he will be with us. Only we know that is. Mm. Uh, that is the thing. So I was sitting in Dindigal, that my native place, my own house, sitting on the top uh, on a chair. Immediately I got a vision after at the time of four o'clock, evening four o'clock. I got a vision of Sri Sai Baba. Oh. I never heard of him. I never went to his. Uh, temple, I know nothing about him. That was before he was famous? No, just some years before. I was oh. famous before, many years. But this, our secret life, our secret spiritual life, this mm. is. So I saw Baba's face only, this much, like this, he seeing like this, full marvel, weight, like that. Oh. Oh, yes, yeah, second. Before that, Ravindra Swami showed his face and it immediately went away. Baba came. So I, I was wondering, what is this nonsense? We never know this man, how he is giving us a picture. Immediately I found oh, my Guruji. Baba, Guruji, what is this? I never know Baba, I never worshipped him, I never saluted him. No, no. I told him, Baba, Guruji, listen, listen. Yes, he told, yes. I never know him, I never asked him, I never uh, worshipped him, but the, that man has come on in my vision. He immediately asked, Sirdi Sai Baba, he immediately asked, Oh, Sirdi Baba has come to you. Yes, 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 Guruji. <laughs> so, how great my Guruji is. Yes. See? Yeah. Immediately, five minutes over, I never told it is uh, Baba. I said only this. I never uh, heard, I never worshipped, I never uh, think of that. But that man has come. That is the word I told. Immediately he told, Oh, Baba Vandara. In yeah, yeah. Oh, Baba has come. So, Guru is one. Yeah. That is the thing. Then, Guru appears through different forms, Form, different persons. Yes. yes. Like that. Different gods even. Yeah, yeah. Or Brahma, you know. Whatever he wants, he will... As a light. Uh, yeah, he is the great, na. Almighty is Guru only. Mm -hmm. Because he is showing everything. One who knows everything is Almighty only. Truth is one, so Guru is one. 
Yes, Guru is one. Always, there are so many, uh, what do you call it, authorities in, in our religious life. Ramakrishna, Paramahamsa oh, told, oh, like that. here it yeah. is, uh, yeah. Ramakrishna, there it is, yes, there it is, Allah, there it is, all one, be careful, he told. Mm. Uh, it is Guru's playing. Yes. It is right. Guru's playing. It's Leela. Yeah. Well, because people are different in different times and places. So they need a different form to, to bring out their love, yeah. their bhakti. That's correct. See, if you, want, if you are saluting to Ramana, Ramana will come one day in your meditation. But not as you worshipped. He will come with any... <coughs> What do you mean? Any in way. his own way. He yeah, his own way. Yeah, yeah, yeah his so own this way. This happened to me too that I was in the beginning a Krishna devotee. So I was doing pujas and so much seva and kirtan and everything to Krishna. And then after many years, I wanted to know well, who is really my Ishta Devata? Mm -hmm. Who is really the form of my perfect devotion? And so I went to some Babas in Vrindavan and I said, how do you know, how, is there a way to know the Ishta Devata? And they said, yes, you chant the Kama Gayatri Mantra mm -hmm. of Jap Japam, mm -hmm. of Kama Gayatri. So I started doing Japam of Kama Gayatri. And Narasingha Dev kept appearing to me. <laughs> huh? And I was saying, well, Wait a minute, <laughs> I'm worshipping Krishna, and now what are you doing? Why are you coming? And he says, well, you keep calling me. So then I realized, oh, actually Narasingha yeah, is the Yishtra Yes, yeah. he is the form. Yeah. And once I began then to put my affection and love and bhakti in him, then everything became clear. Mm. Yeah, so yes. Yeah. Guru See, will come. Yeah. Not in the form you want, but in the form you need. That's what he is telling. Uh, any form, but his form, yeah, that is his uh, choice of right. Mm. 